College of Marin. Yeah. Pretty same. close to that, right? Okay, so, and I'm sure your guys' uh, professors or teachers knows you guys by your name, correct? Mm -hmm. It would be the same way here at Sonoma State. So yes, you are going to a bigger university compared to the JC, uh, but still you are going to get that one-on-one -on -one attention from your professor. You're still going to get that interaction. So that was something I was looking for, and I definitely found that here at Sonoma State. The largest class size you will take is around 200 students, and I know that might sound pretty big, but it's not as big as compared to like 400 or 600 at other universities. And the great thing about um, the class size of around 200 students is that it does break down into smaller sections later on on the week or the day. So for example, if you're taking a psychology class, most likely it will break down into a discussion section later on in the day, or if you're taking a biology course, it will break down into um, a biology section later, um, a biology lab section later on in the day. So that's how we do it. So you still get to meet a professor, you get to meet a TA, you get to meet your classmates. So you still get that one-on-one -on -one, um, interaction, even in the class size of 200 students. So um, there are a lot of great pluses of being a small university, and I will be pointing those out as we go along on the tour. Um, is there any questions right now before I move on and start talking about Salazar? <coughs> no? Okay. So I'm um, talking about Ruben Salazar Hall. This actually used to be our library many, many years ago, but it has now uh, became our administrative building. So if you go throughout the, um, these sliding doors to the right, you will find financial aid, Seawolf Services and Seawolf ID cards. Financial aid, I'm sure everyone knows what financial aid is, right? Okay, so um, please, please make sure you do uh, fill out the FAFSA when you come to Sonoma State because you never know what you can get. Um, you can always find grants, scholarships, and um, uh, if not those, then loans. Um, moving on to Seawolf ID cards. Do you guys use ID cards at College of Marin? Yeah, yeah what do you guys use them for? <laughs> Not much, really. Maybe to go and check out a book in the library, yeah. right? Yeah. Okay. Well, here at Sonoma State, your ID card is very, very important. If you live on campus, it's your key to your dorm, it's the key to your room, it's your key into the recreation center, um, it's your key to, you, to your meal plan if you do have one. Also, it's your key to get um, discounts here on campus or in the uh, surrounding community. For example, we have a green music center.